Good morning, welcome to my channel. If you are new here, I am Emily Lucy Ratch. I've got an Instagram, a TikTok, and a YouTube channel. And today's video is gonna be spring, summer. And I'm so excited because these looks, I have been saying, ah, beautiful. This video is sponsored by Boohoo and all these looks are obviously from Boohoo, but I cannot see another Zara haul on YouTube. There is literally, everyone is doing Zara hauls and obviously Zara is amazing, I'm not saying it's not, but personally for my body shape and size, I never go to Zara and do a big shop because I always end up leaving and thinking, oh my God, nothing fits me. I feel awful and I know loads of you girls have messaged me before saying the exact same thing whereas when it comes to Boohoo I feel like they almost have in mind this mid-size curvaceous body with a lot of their items and I've really got to know their sizing so well so this video is really important because it's all about what we can wear in the next few weeks the sun will be shining we will be able to go to beer gardens we'll be able to socialize with six people oh my god i mean i have loved spending so much quality time with anthony but it has been a while i haven't seen the girls in so long so i am so ready to get glam and have drinks in the sunshine and before you stop me saying girl it's raining outside we're not wearing shorts anytime soon. Let me just recap to what April the 12th was like last year. Thanks Instagram for saving the stories because we can track back what exact weather details were for the moment <laughs> you took those Instagram stories. And look at me, I was having sangria, I was making espresso martinis in the garden, I was wearing a bikini, I was wearing shorts. Obviously we were in lockdown so we couldn't leave and go anywhere but this time, We've managed to stay indoors for the last God knows how long. And now we're allowed to go and enjoy our April and I'm ready for it. I don't know about you girls, but I'm ready. So with that being said, let's get started. I am super excited about this haul and hopefully you can feel the excited energy coming from me on this Sunday morning. Below me, I have so many amazing things I want to show you. I don't actually know where to start, but I think I'm gonna go, when I picked these items, I had like a theme in mind. So I'm gonna go through the theme. So as I already said, these looks have in mind of what we can do when the restrictions start to ease. And apparently, so it says, 12th of April, restaurants, pub gardens will be allowed to serve customers sitting outside, including alcohol. Customers can meet in a group of six people with different households. A maximum of two households can meet to form a group of any size. It also says, if the roadmap goes to schedule, people will be allowed to meet up outdoors, including in private gardens, in groups of six, or from a maximum of two households from Monday, the 29th of March. Oh my God. <laughs> I just want to say as well, I posted this on Instagram and a lot of people said this is only in England, so I'm not too sure about how it works for Wales and Scotland and obviously if you're anywhere else in the world. So with that in mind, I'm going to talk you through the looks that I'm going for. So we've got, I'm thinking, six people in your back garden, you're having a barbecue, you've not seen everyone for ages, so obviously you want to look your best, you want to be like, I've been, you know chilling, looking after myself in lockdown. I've glowed up, my skincare is on point, my hair is shining, hair masks, you know, I want people to compliment my hair. <laughs> but let's not forget, they need to compliment the outfit. So we've got a barbecue in the garden. Then I've gone for pub beer garden. So I've noticed, I'm pretty sure you girls will have noticed as well, if you drive past any of your like restaurants that you usually go to or pubs, they are getting ready for this. There's literally like teepees outside. There's like um, gazebos. There's literally like gazebos outside of every pub right now and restaurant. So they, they are ready for this and I'm excited for them. We've got one in Leeds that we absolutely love to go to and it's Henium Mill in Headingley and they have patio heaters outside and I just, I just love it. Their food's so good. It's like our breakfast, lunch spot after we've been to the gym. But then also we love to go like on a Friday, Saturday night when they have the patio heaters on, all the lights are on. It's just such a good vibe. I'm like so excited. So <laughs> that's what I'm thinking of. But then I've also noticed like the bougie restaurants are also doing the whole gazebo and you know, tent things. So obviously they can have people to come and sit outside. So 
I am guessing they are also going to be doing things. So in Leeds we've got San Carlo Flying Pizza. I'm praying to God they take the roof off and open the other door so that they can let us in and have <gasps> Italiano. I'm so excited! So that one is obviously a little bit more bougie. I'm not going to be rocking up in, you know, joggers. I'm going to want to make a little bit more of an effort. So I've put that look together as well. And then... You know, you cannot forget about a good old park. There has been many a time in my lifetime where the sun has been shining, I have lived in a flat and I haven't had a garden, and all of me and my friends or my boyfriend have headed to the park in Leeds, in Hyde Park or Brown Deer Park, and we've literally just sat there and sunbathed and had a picnic all day, and it's just been the best vibes. So you'll be able to do that with six people so soon. So I've planned an outfit for that as well. So let's get going. So first, I'm gonna do the barbecue vibes. And obviously, depending on the weather, like I said, looking back in 2020, April was kind to us. And I think we've gone through enough in the last 12 months that the universe is gonna send us an amazing April. And I mean, when I think back, I've had some absolutely gorgeous Aprils. I remember when I was living in London and the weather in April one year was just unbelievable. It was like 30 degrees, it was amazing. So I'm praying to God, the universe to send us the sunshine and good vibes because can you imagine lockdown is lifted where I see six people go to beer gardens and the sun is shining oh, England will just be a very very happy place so what I have got first to try in the hopes of this weather being amazing is a swimsuit. I've got this one in a size 14 and it is part of the Boohoo control range. I have got one already from Boohoo in the control range in a 14 and it, it is a little bit too big so I'm thinking this might be a little bit too big as well. I don't know why I didn't get it in a 12 but I might be pleasantly surprised and it might actually come up quite small. I do like that it's got these like little tie details so you can make it higher or lower because I do feel like I'm quite small in this area here so I always have to like tighten my bra straps and things like that higher. Um, and I just thought it'd be really nice to wear with denim shorts and like a big, you know, shirt over the top or I've got this really cute jacket to put over the top. But when you're in your friend's garden and it's sunny and you, you know, you want to get a bit of sun on your bod, this will be perfect because you'll be covered here, it'll be controlled, it'll be pulling you in just like a bodysuit. But you'll be able to have your arms on show, your legs will be out because you'll have your shorts on and you'll just feel comfortable but catching those rays. So that's the first one I've got to try. The shorts I'm going to try it on with are these ones called tall high waist frayed denim shorts in a size 40. I do think I've already got these. I think these are the summer shorts of these are. These are the summer shorts of 2020 that I went mad for. Um, I didn't realise they were the same ones, but these are a size 14 and I get them in the tall because I don't know about you girls. I'm between 5 foot 2 and 5 foot 3 and for some reason every single brand wants to make shorts that show my arse cheeks and I don't want to keep pulling my shorts up, especially when like my thighs are rubbing together and the shorts are getting further and further up and it's literally like well, I might as well be wearing knickers because they are literally just riding up so much. Whereas if you get them in a tall, they are a game changer, they stay longer. I also like to size up so that they are longer and then I'll put a belt on or anything like that and I just find that's the best way to be comfortable. Then, to put that look together, because obviously when you're walking into the barbecue or if you're having the barbecue at yours and people are arriving, you don't want to just be like fully naked and everyone's just like, Jesus, she's like in a swimsuit and shorts, why did that happen? Because obviously people have not seen you for a long time. So you might want to cover up a bit and look quite stylish. So you can either put like a cardigan with it, an oversized shirt, maybe even something like that I'm wearing today. Or this wild card, which I haven't seen yet because I'm opening it right now in front of you. But on the website it looked gorgeous and it is a cropped trench. The top is like a trench coat, military style, but then it's cropped. So I'm excited to see how that looks all together. It might not work, it might look, truly look horrendous because there's a lot of different variants going on. Um, but if it does, I will show you and then I'll show you what I do to make it look better. So let's try that on right now. Okay, so the swimsuit, this one is the 14, and it does fit really well, definitely because it's got the um, control feature in, I definitely think I could have sized down, because there is like, 
it's not tight do you know what i mean like i think if you wanted to i'm just a bit scouser <laughs> it, do you know what i mean it's not like like it's not pulling me in enough very similar to the shapewear why i sized down the shapewear is because i want it to like pull me in whereas i can just feel i can like let my stomach go and it's not going to suck me in whereas if it was tighter i feel like it would really like pull you in here but if you you know like things a little bit looser you don't want things to be like cutting into you then definitely the size 14 does fit it fits really nicely but me personally i think especially if it's a control one i want it to just be like a little bit tighter so just grab the fabric there and show you so, so there's like that much fabric i could tighten and that's what i'm guessing what the 12 would be like but it would just pull you in so much more here so it'd be like tighter so i definitely think if you're a similar size to me you can size down in this and especially because of this neckline you can really adjust it to be higher or lower support but i really like this and i'll definitely be getting it out in summer for different events and i'm going to try it on now with the shawl so these are in a tall 14 so as you can see the length is just so much more fluttering they're not like you know when you see <laughs> see them and they're literally like walking around and then they're just like you flab hang it out these are so much longer so you're not constantly pulling them out of your crotch <laughs> and the fit is just so good <gasps> love these <gasps> i just love them always deliver boohoo you always deliver on the denim shorts wow so they are just perfect there's a little bit of room that cutting into me they're not too short oh this is a vibe so can you imagine it's sunny you're having a barbecue in the garden you want to get a bit of a tan you want to feel the sun on you but you don't want to be too like you know you want to suck in certain areas yes yeah, so yeah i've got my arms on show but i'm going to show you some alternatives that you can do right now to cover this area up so now i've just thrown the jacket over the top and initial reaction i was like i'm not sure because obviously it's quite big i do really like it though i love the sleeves it's very on trend for spring summer and i do actually i've grown to like it now i think yeah actually it is a good it's a cool vibe because obviously you wouldn't keep the jacket on it's just for certain situations like when you're arriving when you are leaving when you are standing up you know you put this on and then you just have your legs out i do actually like it i love it with the gold jewelry i just love khaki in summer i just think it's such a good vibe and see the gold bangles and jewelry on it's looking cool but if you wanted to wear something that was maybe like on all the time you could do your full blazer look so this is obviously quite smart black sandals swimming costume underneath blazer on top you know very like dressy or if you wanted to go a little bit more casual and think right i'm going to leave this on all day while i'm sunbathing because i feel a bit self-conscious about my arms you could wear you could do a blouse like this instead so i've still got the swimsuit underneath um obviously you can do a black blouse if you wanted to but at least you can just take it off if you wanted to but you're covered and you've just got your legs out and then you've got like a little bit here showing and then at least you can just be like oh you know if i want to i can take this off and i've got swimming costume underneath and sunbathe and then put this back on later when it gets darker and then you can put this on if it's time to get a bit cool you can put this back on just to give a really cute summery vibe so the shorts and the swimsuit 100 a hit so before we go on to the next outfit i want to show you some accessories that i picked up from boohoo because obviously i've been putting them through as well these ones are lovely so i got some gorgeous sandals last year from boohoo and i have worn them to death they are amazing so i've gone for a very similar style this time and it's just like an open flat foot get your hand nice and there nice and wide and they're just so simple and nice so i love all sandals from boohoo and they're really affordable then there's also these ones which are a bit wild for me these ones again are wide fit because i just want to feel comfortable i don't want my feet to be like when you're hot in the summer your feet swell <laughs> my feet swell so much in the summer it is a joke so i've gone for a wide fit these ones are the ones that like wrap up your legs as well and i think they are gorge love the like suede detail and the flat foot kind of 
no platform vibe. I think they are perfect for summer. Throw it in your bag. So you want to wear heels a little bit. You take your big bag with you. You want to throw it in some cross sandals. They're good. Talking of bags, I love a straw bag in summer. And this one has not disappointed. I'm so excited about this bag. It looks gorgeous. This bag is called Circle Handle Straw Bag Large Natural One Size Vibes. That is like complete in all of my outfits for summer. Obviously you can't like put it over your arm, but it's more like this, this, just love it. I think in summer accessories are so important. I mean, accessories are always important, no matter what time it is of the year, but I think in summer you can be so playful and like girly with accessories and this is the vibe. Then I also picked up some gold jewellery. If you haven't already seen, I did a Springs Trend video on last Sunday, last Wednesday, I can't remember. It was like last week. And it showed you all the trends that are coming through for spring, summer. Gold jewellery, still a massive trend. So I picked up these bangles. They are obviously like a Cartier ripoff kind of vibe, which, you know, I'm not, I'm not even angry about because they are beautiful. So I will be putting those on as well. Love them. Love a gold watch to go with it all. And oh, let's just try it on quickly now. Vibes. Be wearing them every day in spring, summer, you know? That is a really good bundle. And then I also got another bangle. I feel like bangle, gold bangles are a big thing right now. So I didn't want to miss out. And oh, look at this. Even because it's like a little, look at this, a little bag. Oh, that looks way more expensive than it actually is. I don't even know how to open it. Oh. Ready for the ASMR? Ready. Oh, one more time for the ASMR fans. Ready? Oh. Love a good ASMR. Yes, feeling that. Boohoo. Always, always deliver. Okay, I'm getting distracted. So next on the list is pub beer gardens. I'm thinking like you've just finished work, it's sunny, you wanna go enjoy a nice like meal. In Leeds we've got a place called Banyan, which is just the go-to. Like if you want a few drinks, you want like a bargain meal and you wanna just like meet your friends, you're hoping there's a table, it's not gonna get booked up ridiculously. I mean, it probably will right now, but you just wanna go like quite cash, but still make an effort. So I've got you. So I'm thinking sandals with these jeans. And if you follow me on Instagram and TikTok, you will know my obsession with Boohoo Butt Shaper jeans. They have only gone and released a petite version. I'm excited for these. I got them in a size 14 because they do look smaller. The other ones I wear are in a size 12. I'll show you a picture and a video here. So I'm not 100% sure the fit of these, but we will see. But I just thought because they're petite, they might be a little bit smaller. So we shall see. But I do really like the color of those. And then I've got to team up with it. This mega cute top. So we're going jeans and a nice top vibe for beer gardens, which if it's sunny and nice, I just think it's such a good vibe. You're not too naked. You can still have like a little bit of shoulder on show. Nice accessories. Gorge dark jeans, so you're not gonna have like any sweat patches because you're in light jeans. Nice sandal. Toes and nails painted. You'll have been to the nail salon by then, girl. And cute bag. I'm good for this. But I also got this top to try with it, which is very, very similar to the red one, but in blue. I think that might look quite cute with the denim shorts too and with the jeans. So I love a blue in summer. Like this kind of pastel blue spring summer is my favourite. It just, especially if you've got, well actually if you're blonde or brunette it looks really good because it's just a gorgeous vibe all summer long. This one's a really good cute top. So I'll try those bits on for you now. Pub garden vibes. So this is so cute. I absolutely love this top. It is super, super summery and cute. And the jeans, I just knew so it would definitely be smaller than the other butt shaper ones that I always talk about. They do fit like really, really good. Again, they're not like tight on me, but I don't know. They're just, I think I prefer the other ones. Um, I'll link both below as well so you can choose which ones you prefer. But obviously these ones are a bit shorter on the leg if you are petite and then the top is just so cute i just literally tucked my bra into this and put the sleeves down but again it's personal preference maybe you want to like 
have it up like so but I just think this is such a cute pub vibe like I just can imagine you know you finish work you think I'm gonna go meet the girls oh, I feel quite summery so you just throw your jeans on cute little top jeans and a nice top vibes and you go and have some nice dinner outside with the girls and a catch up and a Cosmo I'm gonna come rip the Cosmos I've missed the Cosmos so much so yeah really like this one and then I've also got the blue version of it. This one is a 12 as well. And I just think this is so cute. I put some heels with this one, just so you can see the difference in like dressing it up a little bit. But again, jeans and a nice top will be perfect for any event this summer, this spring summer. So it's a definite great asset to have. This again will look good with the shorts and you could put the other top with the shorts as well. There's just so many different things you could do. White shorts would look great with this as well. Now we are going into the bougie restaurants. We're thinking it's someone's birthday. We can finally celebrate all the birthdays we've missed. We can finally go for an engagement with all our friends, which I'm so excited about. Because it all bought us amazing gifts and I really want to say thank you. We have so arranged a beautiful meal. So, you know, just the extra special events. It might be your birthday. It might be something special happening. It might be just, you know, you want to just get dressed up because why not? We've been caged animals for a very long time. So I have gone for, in a size 14, this maxi dress. It looks like it's like a polka dot, but it is obviously a polka dot, but it's actually floral. And I went for a 14 instead of a 12, just because when you do the wrap, I think it's actually better to have more fabric than not, because obviously you can make it smaller. Whereas if you went for a smaller size, you can't make it bigger. So you're always gonna have a bit more room to tie it and move the fabric around a little bit. So when you sit down, you're not gonna be like, oh, there's my underwear because there's not enough fabric to cover. So I've gone for a bigger size in that one, but we'll see what that fits like. So <laughs> I really like this. The only issue is it is a lot more booby than I thought. I literally feel like my nipples are gonna fall at any point. Um, but I think you could put a bikini top underneath it or like a shape wear bodysuit underneath it or even the swimsuit that we had on at the start um, and then obviously a little bit of black would just show underneath it um, and then the only other thing as well is the slit is quite high so they are my pants <laughs> and yeah I think obviously it's just there's nothing to keep it there so maybe like I say you could put the shape wear body underneath it or you could wear like a slit, slit underneath it or even cycling shorts and just make it quite a cool vibe when I'm up to here. Or this would be a really great beach dress to so say like if you're going on holiday and you, you want to go to like a beach club or something and you want to throw something on for lunch and you could have your bikini underneath it. I think this would be a really good vibe for that. But maybe not what I originally had in mind for going for dinner and things because I feel like you would be conscious that your boobs were going to slip out at any point. Um, and I have actually put them to like the highest bit there. I think it's just the way that the dress gapes. Um, yeah, I do really like it, but I just think I personally would feel pretty conscious while sat eating dinner. <laughs> and then I also have another look, which is a very birthday vibe. And that is this coral suit told you, I'm not messing with these colours. Like, I am fully spring summer vibes right now. I remember this time last year, I got loads of bits from Boohoo um, because a really good tip is to start shopping for summer stuff now. So I did a post, I'll actually show you it's here, and it, it did all right on Instagram. And then, this was in March, April time I posted this. Then, come May, I think it was, I reposted it on TikTok because everybody was like, what can I wear? I've got no idea what to wear. And then all of the items that were in that video sold out before they could buy them and they never came back in stock. So this is a real lesson learned is to buy a lot of the summer stuff now and in it, so it March, April, then when everybody actually starts to realise they should have bought stuff and they've got nothing to wear in May, June and they can't find anything, I'm not joking when I say there is literally never any shorts in stock, there is never any bikinis, never any swimwear, it is literally... <laughs> A joke when it comes to like June, July, you can't find anything, and anything that's left goes in the sale, and it's kind of just a bit like it's okay. Whereas all the good bits, if you want this to be your glow up summer, where everyone's like, Oh my god, you look so good! That outfit is amazing. Where'd you get it from? You can be like, I got it in March, and I'm sorry, it's now out of stock because that is that's how it works. And the smart shoppers that's why they always look the best. So, 
This suit is in coral, and I think this will be so nice for like weddings that are coming up. You'll always be able to get this out in summer because it's just a really nice transitional, you know, year to year suit. And races, weddings, christenings, birthday parties, brunches, you name it. So it is a coral suit. I got this one in a 14 again because I just knew the shorts would be tiny and they do look quite small to be fair, but we'll give it a go. Um, and then it comes with the matching blazer in this gorgeous coral color. Can you imagine being on holiday, flat shoes, gorgeous tan, white bodysuit and coral suit. And you're just literally like living my best life, back on holiday, been through the COVID hell, but I'm back, coral. <laughs> so the bodysuit I've got to try with it is one of the new styles of bodysuit. This one's a double layer racy bodysuit in a 14. And it is like a so. Just very simple, lowish back. And I think that'll be perfect to go with that coral. So let's try those on for you now. So this one I'm pleasantly surprised. The shorts actually fit perfectly. However, the bodysuit is too big, so I've had to tie it into like a little knot here at the back so that it fits me. Um, but the coral colour, I just knew it would be amazing. Absolutely love this. And like I said, this will be such a vibe where you can either wear it with flats or heels and it'll be great for an event. But obviously I've got in mind that I'm going for like a nice sit down dinner outside to celebrate, you know, the fact we can go out. So this is what it looks like with the blazer on as a whole set but I mean the shots on themselves I just really like anyway coral is just a dream like what a gorgeous summer color and I love it with the white I just think it makes such a statement it makes it look clean fresh summery super cute really really like this outfit and I will definitely be wearing this as soon as I can Okay, so our final look is for the park. Again, we're thinking gorgeous weather, or even like, it's not super sunny, but it's warm. We're talking like 16 degrees. Like, you don't have to wear a, a proper coat, you know what I mean? You just have to walk around, you can get your legs out. It's just, you know, there's just a vibe in the air where everyone's happy because we can finally see our friends, family, you know, just go out, socialize, leave your house. I actually haven't left the house since four days. I haven't left the house, not once. I've been in this house for four days. And obviously I can go out, but there is nowhere to go. I've literally been working every day, been working out in the house. I haven't left the house for four days. So there is nowhere to go right now. So this is one thing that I'm looking forward to the most. It's just been like, I actually can go places. I actually can meet people. I actually can organize things. Um, so I'm really excited about that. And these looks have that in mind. So you can do the swimsuit shorts look with an over shirt or something like that if you wanted to. I did do something similar to that last year, which I'll show you here for the part. Then I've got this to try. We've got two different looks here again. <clears throat> this is in a size 14, a play suit. See, I'm really funny about places because I'm quite short in the body and then I'm always a bit like, my stomach, it's just like not tucking me in enough because it's like baggy. But I feel like because this is black and it's long sleeve, it might look really nice. So I'm looking forward to trying that. I have been looking at that on the website for a while. So I think that'll be a really good addition to have in your wardrobe all summer long and get it out every year and just be like, I've got my go-to play suit. So fingers crossed, that's what it looks like. Then a little bit of a different vibe to what I would usually go for, but I just think it will be so cute with a nice bag, is this. Oh, can you imagine, just like, do you wanna go on a date and meet me in the park, and then you show up in this, with flat sandals and a nice bag, and you're just like, I'm so cute, I've been just saving this dress for the perfect occasion. It's for you. So, <laughs> I think that's just such a nice, gorgeous little like, you know, date, cute, have a nice day, take some photos of me out and about kind of vibe. So I'm gonna try that on for you now. I'm so happy this one is just as nice as I expected it to be. And it is quite short in the body. That's one thing I will say. I feel like it's very like, yeah, like I'm quite short in the body anyway. I'm 5'2", as I said earlier, 5'2", 5'3". So if you are tall, I think you will probably struggle with this, but I'm really happy with it. I think it's really nice. I've teamed it up with the sandals and the bag and I just think super cute for you know, going to the park, like I said, meet people, 
just been a really great summer staple to have in your wardrobe for different events. You can wear it with heels, a night out, dress it up. If it's too low, you could put like a lace bodysuit underneath it or just a black shapewear, bikini top, swimwear, anything. I think it's just really nice. You can wear it in winter with tights and again, like a different shirt underneath or something and make it look different. But I think it's a great asset to have in your wardrobe. Okay, so th this is such a shame, but this is a 14 and it's just does not fit me at all. I definitely need to size down. I got it on without even realising there's a zip. So yeah, I think if you're gonna go for this, it definitely needs to be maybe a size down. Um, because it's not tight on the waist, it's just too much, it's too baggy here. So it's quite hard to tell what it's gonna look like. The overall style of it I actually really like. I think the sleeves are so cute, the fabric's nice, it's nice and thick cotton. And I just think it'd be so cute to wear with the little bag. Like I said, to go to the park, just, you know, look girly, feel cute, but it needs to fit. <laughs> so size down. Okay, so I hope you enjoyed that video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up, make sure you subscribe. And I'll also add at the end of this video, loads of my other playlists and videos that you might find helpful. I've done stuff for flattering a tummy area. I've done flattering dresses, flattering tops. Flattering skirts is coming soon, but all these amazing pieces you can add to your wardrobe and they'll be your go-tos to put on and think, yes, I'm ready to experience life i'm not gonna hide if you've gained any weight over lockdown don't feel bad a majority of people have gained weight over lockdown so everyone's in the same situation do not decide to stay indoors and hide because you are concerned about what other people will think own that weight gain be your best self invest in some good pieces that are going to make you feel your absolute best so you know when you put them on or you've got an occasion that you need to go to you're like right i've got an outfit so i'm not going to feel stressed and be like i've got nothing to wear you need to have the right outfit that makes you feel good planned so you can put it on and then instantly it will just be the best mood booster so thank you so much for watching and i will catch you guys super soon bye